Most of these children in Assam village had never seen a merry-go-round or any kind of playground equipment until today. But this merry-go-round, designed by Brigham Young University engineering and technology students, is much more than a toy. These villages don't have electricity. Uh, the children push the merry-go-round. It will generate electricity that will light the school rooms. The idea for an electricity-generating merry-go-round originated with Ben Markham. While he was serving an LDS church mission in Ghana, he noticed the schools lacked two things. Electricity electricity and fun. In the rural villages, the kids almost have no toys. I seldom saw the kids playing with anything other than maybe a, a car tire or something else that could be used as a wheel. Working with Markham and colleagues in Ghana, BYU students engineered the device to be easy to push so it would be play, not work. That spinning is converted through a gearbox. A gearbox takes their rotations and times it by 35. And so we've tried to balance fun and getting an interesting amount of power off. For some 10,000 schools across Ghana that have no electricity, the merry-go-round is an economical power source. Using kid power, it recharges a battery station that will then charge portable LED lights, which can be used in the classroom and used at home in the evenings. The amount of power available would easily recharge cell phones, laptop computers, which will probably be a use that we'll, we'll look to in the future. In addition to providing a power source, the merry-go-round is a hands-on science lesson. That is going to encourage many of them to even want to find out more about science, and we may even get some scientists from here. You never know, there might be a Thomas Edison waiting to be discovered. Assam is the first village to receive an electricity-generating merry-go-round, but the hope is that this simple idea will light up many African schools in the future. It's a double dream come true, because we are going to get equipment that the children can play with, and then at the same time, they are going to get electricity from it. It's like a miracle to us. We are very grateful to the BYU. Reporting for BYU, this is Julie Walker.